Hi, writers. Welcome to lesson number eight. This lesson is going to be on writing a catchy introduction in your reviews. So we have all of the things that we have learned to do to convince your readers in your review that you're writing. So today I'm going to teach you that writers write introductions to grab their readers' attention right from the very start. And one way to do this is to talk right to your reader. So when you are introducing yourself to a new person, you don't just go up to them and just start talking to them. You introduce yourself and you might ask some questions. So we're gonna learn how to do that today in our opinion writing. So one way to start a review is to ask questions to make your reader wonder. Then you can answer the question in a way that names your topic. And your introduction will also give you a chance to say your opinion. So here is a chart that we have that gives us some step-by-step -step instructions on how to write a catchy introduction. So first, you're gonna ask questions to make your reader wonder. Second, you're gonna name your topic. What's it called or what is it that you're writing a review about? And then the last thing that you're going to do is share your opinion. So I'm gonna show you how to do that today by doing a writing. We're gonna look at one of the reviews that I already wrote and I'm gonna make a catchy introduction. So let me show you my writing here. This is a writing that I did about Lord's ice cream in the, another lesson that we had in this unit. And I wrote this and it right now says, I like Lord's ice cream. It is located in downtown Livermore. One reason I like it is that they have a lot of flavors to choose from. Coffee is one of my favorites. Another reason is it has cute booths to sit in. And then I go on to tell more reasons and details, but I wanna take a look at the introduction and we're gonna do a little bit of revising. So in this introduction, I started right away with my opinion and that's what we learned to do when we first started doing this unit. But now that we're getting to be more advanced writers, we're going to learn a better way to do that. So the first thing that you wanna think about is what can you ask your reader to make your reader wonder? And one way that you can do that is start with, have you ever, and then think of a question that's related to your topic, or did you know, and then write something that's going to make your reader wonder. So I'm going to just get a new piece of paper because I don't have room to fix my introduction on here. So I'm just going to start again on a new piece of paper. And I'm gonna think about a have you ever question or did you know question? That is a good start to my writing. So let me think about that. You think about your topic at home and see what you can come up with. Hmm. Have you ever wanted a delicious dessert after dinner? That's one option. Or did you know that Lord's ice cream has the best ice cream in Livermore? Hmm. I think I like my second choice better. So I'm gonna start with that. Did you know Lord's ice cream has the best ice cream in Livermore? Okay, so I asked a question to help my reader wonder. Now I need to look at my second step, which is to name the topic. So I already kind of did that in my question because I am talking about Lord's ice cream, but I'm gonna restate it in another way. Did you know Lord's ice cream has the best ice cream in Livermore? It is an ice cream shop located 
right downtown. So I'm telling my reader, talking to my reader and telling them exactly what they need to know to go there. It is, it is an ice cream shop located right downtown. I think, now here's my opinion. So now I'm on step three, I'm writing what I think. I think it's, the most delicious ice cream I've ever had. Now I'm telling my opinion, okay? So now I have an introduction to my writing that isn't just telling my reader the topic right away. I'm introducing my topic and trying to get my reader's attention so that they will keep reading my review and not say, oh, this is boring. I don't want to read this, okay? So now I can look back at the rest of my writing and I'm gonna take out my introduction from before and I can add this right on. So now I have my introduction. Did you know Lord's Ice Cream has the best ice cream in Livermore? It is an ice cream shop located right downtown. I think it's the most delicious ice cream I've ever had. One reason I like it is that they have a lot of flavors to choose from. So now it goes right into my reasons and details after my introduction. Okay, so today your job in writing is to look at a review that you've already written and see if you can revise your introduction to make it even better. Okay, good luck today. I will look forward to hearing your writing. Bye.